Start to give up. What's good, y'all? This is your boy Jack back again with another video. Today, we're going to be doing a unboxing and first impressions of the what is this? The uh, it's a case for the uh, iPhone 15 Pro Max. So, we're going to go ahead and check it out just like in all my other videos. Please like, share, subscribe. It really, really helps out the channel. And yeah, let's go ahead and uh, check it out. Let's see what we're working with. I think this is a similar case to what I have already. Oh, no, no. Oh, no. This is different. This is different. This is different. This one has the uh, camera little cutout cover thing. So uh, here we go. You know, nothing really to write home about. We'll move this to the side. And uh, here, here it is. So this is the, uh, the little camera slide situation. This one doesn't twist or anything. And then you have the little, little ring and it rotates. So it's pretty dope. So you can have it in different orientations and things like that. You know, I, I like it. Let's see, let's go ahead and uh, let's, uh, throw everything in there. Make sure everything's all wiped down. And baby girl right there. There we go. So all the buttons and cutouts is what it looks like. It's a thin case, minimalistic little situation. You know, saying all the buttons work and things of that nature. Right there. Yeah, I mean, everything works. Let's check out right here. So I have these camera covers on there. So it's kind of like a nice little slide situation. You know, and you, you can adjust like like so. And then what we're gonna do, we're gonna grab a little charger. Let's see what the MagSafe situation looking like. So we'll pick it up from here. We'll give it a little shakeage. Oh yeah. Oh no, it's legit. Okay, yeah. No, nah, it's, 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 it's legit. So, again, this is a nice little situation. I'll leave a link in the description. And, uh, yeah, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a two-part. So I got a few other items. So we'll just slide this off to the side. We'll just make this a combo video. So um, I'm doing another drive by Move Speed. I got the 256 ver gigabyte version uh, a while ago, and it was pretty good. It was pretty good. But then I realized, I was like, hmm. You know what I'm saying? They had a 512 on there. So I was like, you know what? Let's go ahead and slide that one. <laughs> you know? So, you know, nothing wrong with a little bit more storage and things like that. Uh, the, the, the speeds are legit. You know what I'm saying? I, I would imagine that these speeds are pretty much pretty similar to the other ones. I'm looking at the branding and things of that nature with the whole thousand gigabytes and, 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 and things of that nature. Or a thousand megabytes, rather. That's what yeah. Um, but yeah, so I'm thinking it looks exactly the same, but it's just, uh, all right, all right now I'm struggling. Okay. All right, here we go. I was about to see me struggling. Y'all want to see me struggling. Uh, here we go. Same little setup. Usual books and stuff is down there. Ain't gonna worry about that. Here's the drive itself. USB A, USB C. And yeah. Nothing really to write home about. I mean, it's a, it's a drive, got the lanyard. You can hook it on up. And then, yeah, let's uh, we're going to go ahead and, 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 and try it out. We're going to do the same test as we did last time. Let me go ahead and bring the files app over. Um, let me see. We're going to grab the drive. We're going to pop the drive. Oh, man, I got I can't do it with this case. Um, I'll, I'll plug the other one in there. I'll plug the other video in there just so you guys can see what the speeds are and things like that. The speeds are legit. So I'm not going to hold y'all. Now we got this uh, USB-C charger It's a, from Best Buy, 65 watt. So if you need a replacement for um, your Steam Deck or, or, Al or Ally or anything like that, this would be a good option. I'll leave the link in the description. Nothing really to write home about. Pretty straightforward packaging. And here we go. Here we go. Got the little flip down. It's not super heavy. You got your 65 watt right there. Plugged in. And what we're gonna do, we're gonna grab a, you know what I'm saying? We're gonna grab the, uh, Pop this one out. So this one right here, this is the Lenovo one, and this is a 68 watt. 
charger and then we're gonna swap this out like so and we're gonna plug this bad boy in and then what we're gonna do oh man I, don't, I think my steam deck is is fully charged so I don't think it's gonna charge fully but it should give us some indication yeah I don't think it's gonna charge fully let me grab oh my phone well, phone is not gonna do 65 watts but it'll do something We'll just make sure it is, that it's, you know what I'm saying, it's working. This is probably the wrong thing to grab because, you know, the iPhone only does anything. Damn, I ain't got nothing up here that, you know what I'm saying, that, that, that needs to charge because I keep everything charged and stuff like that. And my ALK Zoe A1 Pro is on the fritz. No battery. Want, want. So I'm in the process of uh, fixing that, fixing that on up. But again, you know what I'm saying, it's Best Buy. We'll just move that to the side and then we'll we'll carry on. So um, what we have next, we have a seven port powered USB hub. Let's move all this stuff off the side. I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to see all this. You know what I'm saying? We're just we're just running through them. We're gonna take we ain't gonna take too long. So right here, this is a so if you're looking for extra ports for your um for your PC or something like that, this could be an option. So this is a hub right here, which you get in the box. Here's the plug, right there. This looks like, I'm assuming this is a USB cable, right here. So this micro USB to USB A, right there. Usual books, move that stuff to the side. Move this packaging to the side. And then here is the hub itself. And you know, for a decent price, if you're looking to expand your ports and things like that, I don't think you're gonna be doing no, no transferring data at knockout speeds or anything like that. But you know, if you got dongles and stuff, stuff like that. So if you look on the back, here's all the information right here. Looks like it's a uh, four four amps. And here's your USB 2.0 port right here. And here's all your ports on the front. Yeah, nice little situation. It's black. You can set it on top of a. So you can set it on top of, uh, you know, your um, your PC. So yeah. And then what we got next, we have a four port hub. Four port, yeah, 2.0 hub. So now we're gonna slide this bad boy out here like so. Here's the usual books, you know, for a laptop or another, another desktop. I don't think this one needs power. So I'm gonna crack this bad boy open because I know you guys are gonna be here all day. So move all this stuff off to the side. Move this to the side. All right, so this is the two port hub. So right here, this is pretty cool. So if you wanna take it with you, pops out like so, and then you can plug it in. Port USB 2.0 ports on both sides. So again, if you got extra dongles or anything like that, some light, uh, transfer speeds and things like that. It says it goes up to 480 megabytes per second. I mean, this could be a, a situation. So you can either go, you know, the full on route for your desktop and then do this one for your laptop. And then you gotta, you can kind of be good to go. And now, the last thing that we have available is a universal heads, uh, headset stand with hanger right here. Another Best Buy exclusive. You know, they had a little little sale and stuff, so I just picked up a few things, you know. I think everything totals like 40, like 40 or 50 bucks, and plus I had a gift card. So uh yeah, so here's the the um the device itself. So you can swing it around any kind of way, low cable management. Here is the you know the little rotator thing to put it up or put it down, and then here's your your clamp. So when you're uh, putting it on there, you can actually clamp it onto your um, onto your table. So let's uh, check this out right here, like so. And so now we should be able to loosen this up. There we go. So we're loosening it up right there. And then here we go, right here. And then you can attach it to the table or to whatever. Put your, you know, saying lock it into place, like so. And then put your headphones on there, then you're good to go. So again, you know, nothing to really write home about or anything like that. But, you know, we got some products that some people may be interested in. 
And, uh, you know, if you guys are interested, I'll leave links in the description for all these items that um, that I put on the desk. And then, yeah, you know, we'll kind of go from there. So, again, you know, we got the uh, the case, the seven port hub, I believe it's seven port. Yeah, seven port USB 2.0 hub, travel hub, four port, you know, saying uh, the little headphone stand, the 512 gigabyte uh, fast little USB storage thing. And, yeah. We up out of here. You guys take care of each other. Peace. Oh, real quick. Here's the uh, the case with the stand on there. And I got my charger right here. Pop it on here like so. And it does charge. So no issues. Peace. And uh, real quick, I'm just uh, spicing these videos. I know the, 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 the thing's kind of crooked. But uh, yeah, here we go. I got the 512 gigabyte right here hooked up. As you can see, it's right up in here. And what we're going to do... Uh, this is the video that I just shot, the, you know what I'm saying? And so what we're going to do, we're going to grab this one, grab this one, grab this one, grab this one, and grab this one, grab this one. I don't want to keep you guys here too long, but I just want to show y'all we're going to check out the speed and we're in real time. We're going to copy, and then here we go. And then here, as you can see, it's, it, it's moving, you know? And this is about a good, what? I want to say at least, what, at least 10, maybe 15 gigabytes? of information but then again you'll see see what it pops up in here and again if you want to you know swipe away i'm not going to speed up the video or anything like that because i want you guys to see you know saying if you guys do purchase this particular drive this drive is legit just like the 256 one i didn't you know and again i didn't do any any, any funny stuff or anything like that to get it to get it going but again you're 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 seeing it in real time and you see all these videos that you know saying that i'm moving to there and yeah man i mean it's moving so it's been like uh shit it's just coming up on just about a minute for about what about 20, 15 20 gigabytes worth of stuff but we'll check it out we'll see and you'll see it in real real time 23 gigabytes in one minute you seen it that's what it is 23 gigabytes in one minute or a little bit over a minute whatever you know you guys can do the counter but again i ain't gonna keep you all here too long peace Hey, real quick, um, I thought this hub was going to come in later on in the week, but it came in today before I, um, you know, finished up the video. So I'm going to just go ahead and add it into the video. So at the end, sorry about the video being so long, but uh, if you are interested in a monitor clamp type of a hub situation, uh, Oracle might have you covered. So we're going to go ahead and check it out real quick. You know what I'm saying? Not, this is not going to be too long of a video or anything like that. I just wanted to show you guys if you guys are interested in this. And they have two different colors. They have the silver and they have black. I went ahead and went with the black because my monitor is black for one of my computers. And here we go. Here it is. Uh, I'm assuming this is the uh, cable that goes along with the um, with it. <coughs> Here we go, it's a USB-C to USB-A. So I'm definitely feeling that. You know, I've seen on those other ones, it was micro USB, and I didn't know that. So no books or anything like that, because you know it's pretty straightforward. You plug it in. Oh no, it is, we have books. I apologize. So snap-on hub situation. Uh, let's see, we're gonna get to English. And I will flip it over for y'all so you guys can see it. Okay, there you go. So if you guys want to pause that, if you guys purchase this hub and, you know, saying you guys lose your, your book or anything, there you go. All right. So here's the hub itself. Has a uh, full size, <clears throat> full size card reader, micro USB, uh, headphone jack and two USB 3.0 ports. Now, with the other ones that we took a look at, they were 2.0 ports. So, you know, saying that was uh, the thing for that one. PC in and then the uh, five volt. You know, saying little uh, <clears throat> little charging situation, so you can have power to the USB hubs and then also the card reader. So yeah, you know, real quick, real you know, real uh, straight to the point. And uh, yeah, you know, I ain't gonna keep y'all here too long. This is the uh, Orico, uh, was it Orico? My bad, Orico uh, six in one snap-on hub. I'll leave the link in the description. You guys take care of each other. Peace.